Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today there's going to be a lot of fun stuff, so you'll want to stick around. Don't leave, don't go, don't get up, don't do nothing. Got your coffee? You can go get your coffee. I'll wait a half a second. Just a half a second. I'm still talking. You can get your coffee. <laughs> oh well, <laughs> I know it. Today um, I was listening to the news and I don't know if it'll hit me funny, but it sure did hit me funny when I said it. There was, there was, on the news, it was stating that a lot of men are killing their wives. And I looked over to Jim and I said, don't you dare kill me. And he said he wouldn't. And I thought, and it made me laugh. But another day, I was um, watching him shave. And I said to him, you know, it's sexy to watch a guy shave. And he goes, he's just kind of shaving. And after a bit, he says, is it? And I, I said, no. And it wasn't really. Okay, now, today, the reason you want to stick around, not for that stuff. That stuff is, you know, I'm, that was just coffee, getting your coffee kind of stuff. Okay, now that you've got your coffee and you're sitting down and you're relaxing, guess what you're going to see today? You're going to see, um, you're going to see me, first of all, feeding the chickens again. I did that one other time, but you're going to see me go out to the chickens and let them out because last night it was dark and you couldn't see the chickens. So today you'll see the chickens. You're going to see me wash a part of my door because you don't realize that your door is dirty until you're doing films. And then you think, oh gosh, I wonder how many other people saw that dirty door and they never said anything. That's because you're very nice. You don't say things. That, that makes me feel good because... I notice it and I think, oh dear, that's not good. Then, um, what else? you're going to see me scrub it clean. And then you're going to see it clean. And you're going to get to see, um, this is for Carnamad. Yeah, Jim did a little video for you outside. I didn't know he was doing it, but we're going to play that too. So you're going to see that video. And I hope you enjoy this crazy, all together, video mixed up, mixed up it's it's kind of all over the place but it's kind of fun actually it saved me from having to think of something to talk to you about tonight because it's all put together beforehand i just have to put the clips together and you can enjoy well i hope you do enjoy i'm going to put them in right here well it's time to let the chickens back out We're going to feed them, but I'm going to let them out first and then I will feed them. Mainly because <clears throat> it's the reverse of yesterday. Open the gate. Okay, girls, we'll let you out. We'll unlock the bottom. Unlatch the top. Swing the door open. There they are. For those of you that wanted to see the chickens yesterday, here they are. Oh. Get back in there. And there's my rooster. Pretty boy. And there's brown girl, and she runs. Lady Jane's getting her feathers. Look at her. She's getting better. There's still bare spots, though. It's time to feed them. I know you all are waiting for that part. We'll get it. This is always harder. That's why I let you out first, and I'll get these and bring them in. Oh, okay. Okay, everybody. I'm coming back. Okay, let's go in. Woo! It's a little chilly out today. Oh, you've got the... Here, we got to dump this one, Emma. Sorry. I like to dump that out first. Okay. Let's go over here and do this one. 
This one you tipped right over. I'll dump this one. There you go, girls. Enjoy. Okay. And there they are. Let you look at the chickens for a minute. Oh, it's cold out here, though. Lady Jane, you're looking so much better. You got to get the rest of those feathers. Oh, my goodness. And brown girl, look at you. You're beautiful. You're such a pretty girl. But you're so skittish. You can go in. I'm coming out. Yesterday, I noticed when I went to open the door that this is very dirty here, so we're going to clean it. The cloth isn't doing it well enough, so we're going to use a scrubby instead. What a difference. I guess when you're filming, you see a lot of things that you wouldn't notice, and I'm sure a lot of you others notice it, but you're so kind you'd never say anything. But I shall clean it. Because now I'm aware, I better make it better. There we go. That looks so much better. When that dries, it'll be perfect. Well, my handle area, I think, is clean. It looks way better than it did. Look at that. You can see where I scrubbed. Oh, dear, there's more. I should go down the door more. If you really want to know what your house looks like, you take a picture, and it tells you. A lot of you have asked what I use to, to video my videos other than when I'm using the GoPro. And this is the camera that I use. I use the ADD is what I'm using. And I have it on a tripod. This is what it looks like. And I sit right in front. And I look through the lens. I look right in there at you. It does have the side thing that will turn. Let me put the cover back on. It does have the window that will that I can look in, but I'm not supposed to. You're supposed to look over here. And now you see my kitchen. You know, if you want to know what your house looks like, they say take a picture. And as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff on my counter. And yes, there is a roll of toilet paper. There always is a roll of toilet paper on my counter. Why? Because it's a lot easier to, to wipe your nose on toilet paper and you use a lot less. Sometimes you don't need the full tissue. But they say take a picture of your kitchen or your room and then you'll know what it looks like. And this is my kitchen. So this is what I'm looking at. And see that corner area? Right over here. This is where Jim sits. He sits right on the counter. Well, that's my kitchen. I guess it's going to be just a little chat today. We're going to chit chat about anything and everything. So I'll talk to you all later. Hi, y'all. Uh, this is uh, Papa Jim from Western New York, uh, known of Grace's better half. And as you can see, it's a uh, little bit snowy, a little bit wintry here. Uh, 
just wanted to show you how we do it in western New York. Uh, this is kind of for Carnomad down in Texas. You know, weather doesn't stop us for grilling. We uh, still do our grilling here, just do it a little bit differently. Um, put it just outside, as you can see, just outside the garage door. Uh, so we've got a little bit of a little bit of protection from the weather, but you know that's all we need. And all we need is some good fresh burgers. Well, kind of fresh. They're frozen from Aldi's, but still really, really good burgers. Nice slow cook on them, and that's what is the best thing of all. Don't know how much I'm seeing. I'm kind of watching what I'm doing that through the group through the lens, but um, hey, it is what it is. When you're doing it by yourself, you get what you get. Talk to you a bit. Okay, it uh, everything's all of our burgers are cooked. I know it's getting kind of hard to see. Uh, Let's see what, uh, see I have them <clears throat> sitting on the top right now. It's kind of hard to see, but uh, I will move things around a bit. Let the, bear, the grill burn off and we will be done for the evening. Uh, as soon as this gets burned off a bit, I'll go ahead and shut her down and we'll have some burgers. Talk to you later. Bye. I do have to admit, when I'm out here grilling, I do kind of cheat a little bit. I have a uh, heater buddy, uh, Mr. Buddy, that uh, I do have fired up. And I do come around by it every once in a while to warm up a little bit. Um, otherwise, I'm out here in whatever temperature it is. Um, I also have it out here so that when I'm working on my four-wheeler, which as you can see, I'm doing some work on the fuel filter, spark plug, oil filter, oil change, a uh, little, little maintenance on the machine. Um, whatever. Talk to you later. Bye. Well, are you glad you stuck around? I'm glad you stuck around because all the best stuff's right there and you would have missed it all. And Carnomad, it was delicious. I ate it with hot sauce and um, mustard. mustard. Yes, I put them together. And it actually was really good. So I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Have a great night. Bye-bye. Jim waves bye. Bye. <laughs> bye.